Real estate's TV stars get a dose of reality. How's that for you? Well, guess what? The housing market is the housing market and the Wall Street Journal is here to report on it, both on the TV version and the real life version of what's going on. I'm Shoshana Socher, head honcho of the Socher team and your favorite local real estate agent. Be sure you subscribe to this channel and like this video and definitely comment below so that I can bring you more information just like what I'm about to share today. I'm here to talk about the Cleveland, Ohio housing market specifically July, 2024. And what's interesting to me is that even Selling Sunset is having trouble with the market. Now what's going on in the national market? Let me show you what the Wall Street Journal has to say. Home prices hit record high, limiting sales. Home prices rose in May because remember, we're always looking at housing markets or really markets in general in arrears because it's impossible to predict what a market will be. So we're looking behind us a month or two. Housing prices in May rose to a new high with low inventory com continuing to spur bidding wars among home buyers in some markets. Yes, including in Cleveland. High prices paired with high interest rates have actually limited sales this spring. Sales of previously owned homes actually decreased. Usually what we see is that the number of sales actually rises as we head into summer. What I really want though is to read this next paragraph. So you may have actually seen that if you're one of the buyers that I keep on my waiting list looking for a home in a particular area, stick around for story time. Even though demand is low, Home prices are still rising because high mortgage rates are deterring potential sellers from listing their homes, keeping the supply of homes going on the market very, very low. Or if you're one of my buyers looking for a particular price point, or if you like to combine them both and you're looking for a particular area and a particular price point, it's really maddening, isn't it? Well, that's what the Wall Street Journal is reporting as our national statistics. But what I find is that when I look at what's going on in Cuyahoga County, it mirrors what's going on in each of our suburbs. And it's really pretty true regionally. So whether you're in Lake or Medina or, or Lorraine or Summit or one of our other Geauga, one of our other you know surrounding counties that touches Cuyahoga County, you will notice that what's going on in Cuyahoga County is probably what's going on in your county as well. Depending on where you live, your specific city may have some nuances. It will have some nuances and I'm happy to discuss those too. Just pick up the phone. Let's talk. You can always text me if that's easier and I can get you some hyper local numbers for your specific city. But on to Cuyahoga County. I always like to start with on market and sold units. So when I say a unit, I mean one house, right? Like one house is a unit. And of course there are thousands and thousands of homes sold a year in Cuyahoga County. But what's really interesting is the amount of houses sold in Cuyahoga County is actually down about half a percent year over year. And the closed sales are down 16 and a half percent. So if you're Again, if you're having trouble finding a home, you're not making it up. There's just not a lot out there. And of course, everybody always wants to know about pricing. Well, here's where things stand. Sellers, people are pricing their houses 20% higher than they were a year ago. That's a lot of dough in my opinion. And not for any real reason, because guess what? Houses are selling at 10% higher than they were a year ago on average in Cuyahoga County. Now I was thinking if you flip that and you ask 10% higher, I bet you get 20% higher. If you want that bidding war, you've always got to remember that if it's not compelling, it's not selling. Meaning if you price your house that 20% over, you're not going to get that really exciting like, oh, the feeding frenzy, everybody wants your house. You want to make your house V1 that everybody's talking about that everybody wants to get, just price it right. That's what you gotta do. Price it right, you will get what you are looking for and ultimately you will net more money from your sale. With no further ado, whether you're selling Sunset or you're reading the national news or you're looking for local statistics, the housing market is here to stay. I'm here to help interpret it. And I wanna know what questions you have about our local housing market right here in Cleveland, Ohio. Drop your comments below. You know I'll respond. And meanwhile, make sure that you like and subscribe.